Today we are going to make a clay wall pocket. You can use this pocket to plant flowers in it, or my favorite succulents, or to store things in. It, you are going to take your heart stencil and you need to trace it on your plastic wet clay. So this is the plastic stage. So I am going to make sure it fits on there. Mine fits just right. I'm going to trace my heart with my cutting tool and cut it out. Okay, so that's the back of our wall pocket. Now we are going to cut out the pocket part. Do the same thing, trace it and cut it out. Okay, so now we need to attach these two together. With clay, you have to do what we call score and slip or they're not gonna stick. So I'm going to place this on top of here and very, very lightly, I'm gonna just mark where the top of my pocket is on my heart. I'm going to take my scratching tool and along the edges where I want my pocket to stick, I'm going to scratch just the edges up. We don't want it to stick here, we want it to open, so don't do this part. I'm going to do the same thing on the back of my pocket. So we're scratching it up, this is called scoring, okay? Now we need to add our slip, so that is our watery, clay that we have here, our muddy clay. This is going to be our glue. So add some slip all along the edges. Just take a dab with your finger, dab, dab, dab. Do not rub really hard and smooth out the scratches. That would defeat the purpose, right? So add your slip, take your pocket, put it where it goes, and just very carefully, you're going to pinch along the edges. Don't pinch too hard just enough to squish them together. Squish, squish, squish all the way around the edges. Now, we want this to be a pocket, so you need to lift the pocket up, hold the edges down. See how I'm holding the edges down? And I'm gently puffing the pocket out with my fingers, very slowly and gently, all the way to the bottom. Now, I'm going to take my paper towel Paper towel, wad it up, and stick it in the pocket so that it stays up while it dries and it doesn't stick, fall or stick. Now, I have a wall pocket, but my edges are kind of gnarly, right? They're a little rough. So I am going to take my cutting tool and I'm going to carefully just clean up my edges a little bit. Not too much, we're not, we're just shaving off a few of the bumps here little excess clay and I'm going to use my slip to smooth out all my edges. If you use too much slip, guess what's going to happen to your project friends? You're going to have a muddy clay mess on your hands and your heart's not going to turn out too, too good. So just a little bit all the way around. I used a little bit and do not get more until your fingers start to run dry and it's not smoothing out anymore. So you want to get rid of that crease between the pocket and the heart, and you wanna smooth out your edges. Okay, and now we have a pocket, we have a heart, we have a planter, we have a, I don't know, pencil holder, whatever you want it to be, but now we get to decorate it. So I have these noodles here. You can use your noodles, you can use your pencil, and we're gonna add just a few little decorations. I am going to take if I want to press on my pocket, I need to stick my finger in here to support the pocket and then press down pretty hard to create your, look, that could be a cute flower. You could add some petals on the outside or just leave it as is. I think that looks darling the way it is. So I'm going to add a few flowers here. I'm going to take the end of my bow tie pasta and I'm gonna do some grass and some stems, just rolling it like so. And now I'm gonna make a butterfly flying over here. So I'm gonna take my bow tie pasta and press it in. 
See how my fingers are on the inside and the outside? Try not to rip open your pocket. And I have like a little butterfly there. I'm going to add a body with my rotini noodle, I think is what you call it. So a little spiral body there. Look at that. And I have a little butterfly. You can add details up here or you can leave it be. I'm going to add one little butterfly over here. You have to press the noodles pretty hard to get them to show up. That one turned out great. Look at that. And this one, I'm just going to add some little antennas. These are wall pockets or wall planters. So we need little holes at the top so we can hang hooks or strings through them to hang them. So just take your piece of straw and poke a hole all the way through the top of your heart on both sides. Try to get them even on both sides and make sure to leave a little space from the top of the heart to the hole so that it can support its weight. And voila, there is our heart planter or wall pocket. I had so much fun making these. I hope you did too.